Hey you guys, today I'm going to show you how to screen record on an iPhone or iPad. I'm going to show you guys how to do this on my iPhone, but it's going to be identical if you're using an iPad as well. So have one of these devices on hand so you can follow along. Let's jump right in. So the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure that you have the screen recording option in your control center. Once it's in there, the screen recording process is super easy. So first I'm just going to show you how to add that button in. So first we're going to launch our settings and we're going to scroll down to control center. So in my included controls, this is going to be everything that is in the that's in my control center when I slide down this way. So everything that I have in here um, is going to be found right here. Beneath this, we have more controls, and this is where we can add anything we want into that control center. So this is where we're gonna find the screen recording button, and we're simply just gonna hit that green plus symbol on the left-hand side, and it's gonna automatically add it in so that when we slide down, you'll find on the bottom right-hand side that screen recording button right there. Because I'm screen recording right now, that button is blinking red, just indicating that I am screen recording. Hey, if you're finding this video helpful, you can also support the channel through Super Stickers. This helps fund the channel and it also helps us continue creating videos for you guys. Thanks, and let's get back to the video. So now that the button is here, I'm just gonna quickly review how to do this. You'll slide down from the right-hand side over down to the left corner. Slide down like this. The screen recording button is right here. And when you click this, a countdown is going to be displayed on your screen. It's just a three, two, one countdown, just so you're prepared. And once your screen recording has started, up in the top left corner, you have the time, but that little bubble is going to be red. This is just another indication that you are screen recording. And if you wanted to stop the screen recording, you could click that top left button here, and it will give you that option to stop the screen recording. The next thing I'm going to show you is how to screen share with external audio or screen sharing. And so in order to access this, we're going to swipe down to access that um, control center and then on this record button we're going to press and hold it and what's going to pop up here is a bunch of different apps that we can use so this is going to pop up here as well as that microphone option on or off so we can actually we turn our microphone on which means not only is our screen going to be recorded, but we're also going to be able to record our voice as well while we're talking, while we're showing a presentation, etc. So you can turn this on or off just like that. You can also share your screen with other apps. So to do this, we're just going to go back into that same option. So we'll slide down and we'll press and hold on the record option. And so automatically it's going to say that we're screen recording into photos. This is just obviously showing us that it's going to be saved into our camera roll. But what we can also do is select an app that we want to share with. So if I wanted to share with Facebook, I would select this, Instagram, Meet, Messenger, etc. These are all apps where screen sharing is possible and where it's common to screen share. Like I said, whenever you want to stop that screen share, you can click the red circle over the time like this and stop it that way. You can also stop it just by sliding back down and clicking the red dot once again. Alrighty, you guys, that's it for today's video. I hope that you found it helpful. Uh, maybe you can use this information or pass it on to somebody else who needs it. Thanks again, and as always, I will see you guys in the next video.